and we're back with another video family affair thank you for coming over to the house the up chanel's 48 square presenting the family affair okay we're getting down again with alexis stone from celebrity insider she's bringing us an article on kenya moore okay and what kenya moore is doing out there in these streets after season 12 has definitely aired not in its entirety because i think we got another one coming and then I think it's reunion time for them. But as we have seen on season 12 throughout just about the entire season uh, of episodes that they filmed, Kenya Moore has been looking like a damn fool out in these streets in Atlanta with her Mark Daly husband not even caring one hill of a beans about her. But yet she's going to do this shocking thing now for him when she was basically telling us she was done through with mark okay after we don't seen the majority of season 12 and she's talking about she don't want him to come to her house to see brooklyn and all of this stuff that's another video i got coming out for you all but yeah now she's going to give us a title of uh alex's stone rendition of what she put together for celebrity celebrity insider a title as kenya more shocks fans by advertising mark daly's business honey you truly love this man oh god getting on into the article it says kenya more shocked her fans a few days ago when she decided to promote mark daly's business on social media you can check out this post that she shared on her baby girl Brooklyn Daily social media account below. Some fans shaded her for this move, but a lot of people told the Real Housewives of Atlanta Star that she has a big heart for promoting Brookie's dad's business after the way in which she treated her. My whole thing, why you didn't do it on your social media platform? Why you had to do it on the platform you made for your baby girl? It's only supposed to be fun and excitement and oohs and ahs over there at Brooklyn Daily's uh, platform. Okay? Not putting any special promotion about her daddy's business. Let her do that when she get old enough. Okay? Can you should have left it alone. Totally period or at least put it on your social platform but you knew people gonna be dragging you for fill your followers yeah your twirlers they're gonna be dragging you for fill because they want you to have a happy and fruitful life and they don't like what you have shown on this television screen to us on how mark daly really treats you okay so it's two sides going on kenya two sides are going on and if you don't definitely don't gooped your twirlers they're going to be on you. They're going to be like white on rice on your ass. Okay, I'm just saying. And we, the ones that have always been trying to tell the twirlers that Kenya is fake, foolery, fuckery, fraudulent, giving shitty activity to them as well as us. But they aren't believing at this time. Okay, they are hailing you up. They're praising you, girl. They're doing all these things in homage of you, paying homage to you. But yet, you laughing behind the scenes. Okay. Those who have eyes to see and ears to hear, we, we, we seeing you. We seeing you. But we trying to get the other twirlers or the twirlers to see you as what you really are and not what you're really just showing us on TV. Okay, girl. But anyway, that was my sidebar. Moving back to the article, it says some fans shaded her for this move. But a lot of people praised her for basically upping her soon to be ex or is. Is she trying to divorce him? But like us on my side of people that think she ain't never been married. So she can't necessarily get rid of something she never had from the beginning. Okay. Which is a marriage. All right. But anyway. Going back. It said at SoCo BK is open for carry out and delivery. Daily specials. Uber Eats. DoorDash. Grubhub. Can you caption her post? Someone told her. Don't advertise for him, baby girl. He has zero respect for his child's mother. Speaks volumes of him. Okay. Yes, it do. Uh, another father said, this is why I love Ken. She is a true class act because I wouldn't post his business. Okay. Now, like, I don't know why you think she'll... I'm responding to the comment. I don't think you. I don't understand why you think she's a a class act. She more of a f o o l. Let me repeat that again. She's more of a f o o l for doing this. Okay, cause he gonna take care of himself. He's always has. He don't need her publicity. Okay, not when she dogging him on one hand, then she's trying to praise him on the next hand and promote his business. Are you kidding me? That was my sidebar. Okay, another commenter said. 
Uh, she believes that Kenya has a heart of gold because I wouldn't post nothing, and that's in all caps, to support his business. Okay, no, Kenya don't have a heart of gold. She just having mixed opinions out there on what she's doing. But either or, she gonna stay relevant in them streets. Okay, people gonna keep, or she's gonna make sure people keep her name in their mouths okay good or bad good or bad it's all press okay another commenter said um he will always be brooklyn's dad and she needs to be taken care of it's all about brooklyn and securing her future big ups can you no i commit i, I do a sidebar again on this commenter's comment no because people can say all day long make that wealth in their eyes and they still cannot treat and take care of their children okay so no 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 we have to see what he do as brooklyn grows older and continue to give him kudos at each accolade she steps into but no just because a parent is out there making money don't make them a good parent if they're not putting that money towards their kids okay all righty but anyway going back to the article it says someone else said point me to the nearest restaurant to the left of this one okay i don't care if it's a hot dog stand is a not for me okay i agree totally i agree totally another commenter said that it's pretty obvious that kenya still loves mark honey you truly love this man i wish he would at least respect you because i don't think he loves you at all i'm just saying based on what i see you can try all you want but when a man doesn't want you no matter what you do for him you're just wasting your time that's just the truth i really like you kenya give a heart emoji okay Another follower has another perspective on things or said Soko is Brooklyn legacy. So I understand. Uh, I understand Miss Kenya. I wish Mark was that supporter though. Team twirl. And again, I hate when people be saying these parents out here or out here trying to build their legacy and leave the legacy to their children. Just that and third. No, just tell them you're going to leave them one up you know what i'm saying you trying to lead them something that they can capitalize on if you can okay because how this world is going out there it may not be a business to be left for baby brooklyn okay money talks bullshit walks promises get thrown in the dust like ashes okay we're living day to day i ain't saying you're getting paid day to day but when you ain't got nobody coming in your restaurant because they're shutting you down because of this coronavirus what legacy is there going to be left what business opportunities that she can draw assets from if the building has gone under so people use your words correctly because it ain't all about living, leaving wealth, especially when it's with the dollars and it's not even going to be a form of that type of currency going on as we continue to live in this world. Okay, just my perspective. And then it ends with what do you think about Kenya's gesture? Okay, if you want to know my perspective, fam, I think she's a damn fool. Okay, I'm just saying. And I'm very being very lightly on the food because, you know, when you're in love, you do strange things and you have to experience things bad and good to be able to be a person that comes out with wisdom, depending on how you go with the information. OK, so I just think Kenya needs to work on herself. She needs to get some counseling and, and, and work on taking care of her baby Brooklyn. OK, and whatever she feels she needs to leave for her. Not a whole lot of debt. Because you got a lot of business out here and you ain't, the business ain't doing what it's doing. Don't put that in your baby girl's name, okay? Be fruitful so she can multiply with these assets you're trying to leave her. But no, you're trying to live for yourself. You're trying to live a lucrative life, Kenya. And Brooklyn is just going to have to grow up in that life, all right? But money is not everything, okay? Just like Nene said, wealth is over everything. Because if you don't have the, I mean, I'm sure she said health. If you don't have health, you can't enjoy the wealth, okay? You're just spending most of your time in medical bills, all right? But anyway, that was uh, Alexis Stone. She put out from her employer, Celebrity Insider. Take part of it. Get in them comments. Tell me what y'all thought about subject matter. <coughs> Add on to the conversation. Let's keep it live. Let's keep it going. And I will see y'all next video. But don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the videos. All right, fam. Enjoy and remember to definitely comment. See you later.